Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance, followed by a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning. Welcome back to East Media Studios. I'm your host, Kate Roeder, and I hope you've had a wonderful morning. Now let's hop right into these announcements. Starting this quarter, East High School is enforcing the East phone policy for all East students. Phones may not be out during a teacher's instruction unless given specific permission by the teacher and can only be out during resource, passing period, or lunch. There will be a college representative from Indiana University Columbus visiting today. If you've signed up to meet with them, it'll be held in the conference room in the main office. Boys Golf will be having a call-out meeting today. If interested, please meet in the chamber during advisory or contact Vo Coach Van Vinter at kvanvinter at columbus.in.gov. There will also be a call-out meeting for softball next week on Tuesday, October 24th from 6.30 to 7.30 in room C110. If you have any questions, contact Coach Brummett at russ.brummett at gmail.com. Key Club will be selling ghost grams during both lunches today and next week. Ghost grams can be sent to anyone in the building and cost only $1. Now let's head over to Oliver with a three-day weather forecast. Thanks, Kate. Fall is in full swing, and the weather is finally starting to cool down. As today, there's a nice mild high of 63 and a low of 40 degrees. Watch out for those showers, though, as they'll continue all day until around 8 p.m. Saturday will be much the same, with a high of 63 and a low of 40. We'll close out the weekend by inching ever closer to winter, as it will get down to only 35 degrees. Don't worry, though. We'll climb right back up to the 70s next week. That's all for our three-day forecast. Now back to you, Kate. Now for news on our East competitions with Cameron Claywon. Thanks, Kate. At the beginning of fall break, our marching band, the Sound Spear of Columbus, competed in state regionals. They earned a gold rating and advanced to semi-state and will perform in semi-state competition this Saturday at 3.30 p.m. at Ben Davis. Earlier in the day, they'll also compete in the Bands of America Indianapolis Super Regional. Their Bands of America prelims performance time is 11 a.m. and if they are one of 12 bands to advance to the finals, they will again perform in the evening. Updates on the status of the band schedule can be found on the Columbus East Band's Facebook page. In other sports news, both the boys and girls cross country teams will be competing on Saturday at Saraland Park for IHSAA Regionals. They both start at 10.30. It's all for sports. Now back to you, Kate. That's all the time we have for today. From Oliver, Cameron, myself, and the rest of the East Media crew, I'm Kate Roeder. Thank you for watching. And as always, try to be the best part of someone's day.